In this section, we will be able to know about the area of a rhombus by performing an activity. Click each tab to know more. The objective of this activity is to find the area of a rhombus. The materials required for this activity are sheets of paper, color pens, scale, pencil and a pair of scissors. Take a rectangular sheet and mark the points A, B, C, D. Mark the midpoints of each side as E, F, G, H and join them as shown. Then draw the diagonals H, F and G, E and mark the intersecting point as O. Now mark the points as 1, 1, 2, 2, 3, 3 and 4, 4 with some specific colors as shown on screen such that one part of the rectangle forms two triangles. Now shade the figure according to the points marked. That is, the same point indicates the same color. Cut the shaded parts as shown above and place it aside to form a rhombus. The obtained rhombus is same as the original rhombus. From the rectangular sheet, we observe that the area within EFGH forms a rhombus. And if you join the four triangles HDG, GCF, HAE and EBF as shown, you again form one more rhombus. Therefore, area of rhombus is equal to half of the area of a rectangle. We know that area of rectangle is base into height. So, from the rectangle, we have base equal to AB and height equal to BC or base equal to HF and height equal to EG. If D1 and D2 are the diagonals of rhombus, then its area will be half into product of their diagonals. Thus, we conclude that area of a rhombus is half of the area of a rectangle. Therefore, the area of a rhombus is always equal to half the product of its diagonals.